we can only hope to have pure unbridled excitement for the for the next six weeks that's just it's so exciting for us we have to prepare for the world cup as well it's not just the team that's playing and we're trying to get all our uh, our act together trying to understand how everybody is reacting with other people find the little pinch points of where we're going to argue all those sort of things um, we want to react to the games we want to see everything that happens there'll be nothing pre-scripted we're having a bit of a cut at the whole thing but i'm just looking forward to having a whale of a time for the first time in a long time, Ireland are very close to the top of the tree, and that's very exciting. And it's, it's it's kind of a bit of a pressure that goes with it too. But you know, I think good things. I think we'll come out of our group. That's for certain. Um, but the big one is against France, and then the next big one is the one after it. And um, if Ireland can keep their focus well enough to try and get out at, at pool winners, they get Argentina in the quarterfinal. And if that happens, I hope. And I believe that Ireland have the focus to be able to go one step further than we've ever done in the past and get to a semi-final. Well, I have to say, I'm particularly um, I'm kind of happy with this. I rarely ever wear tweed, you know, and um, I'd be relatively conservative for the most part, but I love this. There's a lovely cut to it. It kind of fits pretty nice. More of a winter suit, and I think that's that's fine. But, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy. This is an Irish suit, too. I kind of like it. This is McGee, so this is pretty cool. <laughs>